Hello, so today is the 3rd of uh, June and 2020 and I'm in the hospital at UCSF and I'm doing readings from my community tab. One of the questions was uh, where will we be next year at this time once we have gotten through this year, hint hint, gotten perhaps rid of a certain criminal leader. <clears throat> so let's take a look. This was from Preston. Preston asked in our community tab questions, where will we be, how will we be, um, about the same time next year. So let's look at June 2021. How will we, how will things look for the U.S.? How will things be going? Let's take a look. <clears throat> Let's just take a look. How will things be going next year at this time in June of 2021 with the United States? Next summer. So let's see. How do things look for next June? How do things look for next June of 2021, America? See what we get. I might have to adjust the angle. All right. Well, we have the Empress as our covering us for next year. And you know, the Empress always, for some people, it can be the fall because she's about fecundity and stuff like that, but for me, um, she's kind of a summary card, always been to me, which is like my favorite time of year, usually. And I'm feeling like that looks good. Let's just see what, but I'm going to get ahead of myself, so let's just see what else is crossing and, and all that. Looks like education. And it looks like the challenge will fall in the way of economy, working on the economy. But it looks like it's the challenge will be to kind of beef it up try to beef up the economy. That's what we're going to be doing. Those two cards tell you that. With the, the um, Eight of Pentacles and the Empress. So that's definitely feeling now to me more like economy <coughs> and employment. Working to get that built up. Um, based upon the Ten of Wands, because we've gone through you-know-what and been stressed to the gills, and all the stress that we have been through this year, and since Trump's been in office prior to, t you know, 20, uh, 2021, um, a lot of stress. trying to work things out. It looks like we'll be working on the economy. Let's see what will be crowning us. Is the Page of Pentacles more about the economy? And I think about new jobs, new jobs in particular. I'm feeling like um, these jobs are, though, 
my concern is that they're jobs that are not long-term type of not everyone is going you know to be a CEO but Um, well, that could be small businesses, so I'm hopeful that. I think we're looking at creating a better economy for small businesses. Because they've been really, Trump has hurt them. The high priestess is in the past, so that uncertainty or the, the things that were unknown will be in the past next year. I think what it's saying too is that there will be some things that go on that we can't see right now that by the time of June next year you'll see um, some of these aspects that are being revealed right here. It's just stuff that we don't know yet. I know you're asking to know what it is. I'd like to know what it is, too. But I think it's connected to economy, because those are the cards closest to it and the stress of jobs and creating jobs for small business. Huh. No doubt we get the emperor. So we get the Emperor and the Empress. That's pretty good because, and it's very interesting, and look, look what connects them, is economy and work. So I'm seeing professional, I'm feeling like this is bigger business and smaller business. It's really businessy, isn't it? <laughs> it's all about economy and jobs large uh, businesses and small businesses and I wonder what it is that will have occurred but it looks to me like there's a state there's st looking to stabilize and really make the economy healthy and uh, new jobs so that it's new jobs are, are being created, new jobs that are not just um, minimum wage jobs, um, you know, but, but also just trying to get our economy to thrive is what it looks like and to get work going. Yeah, right now we're in a state that we're going to have to recover from. <clears throat> this is the Four of Wands. And in our environment is the Ace of Wands. So there's new beginnings. That we're going to see new starts with business. And in particularly where creativity comes into play. I think you're going to see more creative oriented business. Graphics, design, that kind of thing coming to mind, these kinds of businesses. So, it, not just in tech, but there's a, there's a strong creative energy here that's going on next year. And it's going, it's money, I think, that might go into uh, businesses and arts. Definitely. A real accent on that. Yeah, again. Um, and in the placement of hopes and fears, we have the Seven of Cups, which is actually quite good. The only thing that would be a drawback would be that you're so scattered, there's so many possibilities that you need to choose one direction at a time to, you know, flesh out uh, that detail. So there's a lot of creative thought process going on. Um, and it looks to me like we have smart people working on 
creating a healthier America, a healthier economy and job market. And one that has more creativity in it. I'm sorry, just a second. Okay, so I also feel like we have arts and things going on here and creativity. Let me see, where were we at? One, two, three. Okay, that's right. And the final end result is judgment. I think we're able to get to a place where, let's just see, we'll pull a couple extra. Hermit? <clears throat> and the Five of Cups. Hmm. Well, this definitely feels like we're going to need to address businesses in particularly that have not been able to do well under the Trump administration, particularly that have closed down or had problems with it that were lost. I think we're going to be looking at trying to get these businesses and persons involved in that going again because it's important to have individualized businesses and not just all these corporations that own everything but I see that there is like a, a depressed feeling within regard to more individualized uh, businesses and they're wanting to I feel like Make have the biz, have the government make changes that help the individual that's lost a lot, especially through the pandemic and the other problems that you know have been going on, where we have um, protests and stuff that that are necessary to call attention to brutality. But I see us working on that, on economy and job market. Yep. And I think we will eventually see a healthier situation emerge. It's going to take some time, though. All right, I'm going to upload this.